What is up everybody? Welcome to Mount Mograph. I got a goodie giveaway for you guys today. Uh, this is the magic flip script. Uh, it's very easy. It pretty much makes an effect that you've seen for a lot of commercials in a lot of motion graphic work. It pretty much just automates the task for you so you don't have to waste your precious time doing stupid things. Anyway, here it is. Uh, this video just kind of shows off one direction of movement, but you can actually do multiple directions at once. I mean, it's a 3D layer this will make for you and you can go all kinds of different directions directions you can use this on layers text uh, compositions and like I said this is just going up and down but you can go left right diagonal any direction you want uh, how you get this script is if you just go uh, to the link below it'll go to my website you just go over here to freebies and this is the first one I've put up here and you just click this download the magic flip script you just click that download it drop it into your applications uh, after effects scripts scripts UI folder restart after effects and uh, pretty much you open up after effects go to your window and go down to the Mount Mo magic JSX bin and it'll probably pop up undocked uh, and then you can just resize it to whatever you want. You don't have to dock it. It's just one button uh, and you just put it over here and call it good. So here is what the script does. I'm just going to create a real quick uh, composition. Um, it's going to just flip your objects for you and uh, it actually is cool. Um, it's not like a crazy effect. I was just kind of playing around and uh, made it and I thought it was cool enough. Uh, this is going to be, it was going to be featured in the Mount Motion pack that's coming out on uh, June 20th. I actually have a release date now. Uh, here, wait, I should stop talking and type. But anyway, yeah, I have a big script pack coming out that's actually going to be really, really cool. I'm super excited about it. Um, and that's coming out June 20th. And so I made this one and I was like, you know what? It's not cool enough to include in the pack. I didn't know what to do with it. So I'm going to put it up for free. And anyway, what you do is you create a layer. Uh, you can put this wherever you want. I'll just center it. And uh, then you just select a layer and you click magic. So what this does is it makes your layer 3D. Um, you also get a little pop up in your effect controls and it adds some expressions to your layer. You don't really have to worry about them. So if we pr press R to go to our rotation, I'm just going to rotate one of these directions. And so as soon as it gets um, parallel to the camera, it's going to disappear. And so how could this be helpful? Well, it's helpful when you want to transition between two objects. So if I duplicate this layer and uh, just rename this layer, I'll call it like motion. Uh, the next one will be cool guy. I don't know why I typed that, but anyway, so this cool guy layer still has that magic effect and that's just because I duplicated the layer. But if you go up into your, your little effect controls and just click this checkbox here, it's going to actually flip our layer and we won't see it anymore because it's going to be faced opposite of the camera. So I just once again automated a task. If you go into your rotation, we'll see both of these have becoming 180. So then all you have to do is parent the layer that you want to be on the back of another layer to your first layer. So I'm going to grab my uh, pick whip and uh, just put it on over here. And uh, now when I rotate my motion layer, we'll see that as it rotates, all of a sudden it is a different object. So you can do this for forever and it's pretty cool. Um, it's a nice way to just transition between objects and uh, this obviously will work for any direction. So, you know, you can go crazy. It's going to be upside down in that aspect, but um, yeah, you can just rotate your layer however you want. As you can see, uh, this is kind of cool. Um, it's not the most amazing thing in the world. Uh, it's a very uh, often used effect and this just makes it a little bit easier. So this looks kind of cool. Um, once again, you can do this for compositions. So I'll just create a comp within a comp and you can, uh, you know, put some kind of animation on here if you really feel like it. Um, I don't know. I'll just spin this around for a second and then go on over into another composition. Drop that uh, new comp in there um, if I can. What did I do here? Oh, I put this. Uh, sorry. I just was uh, not really paying attention to what I was doing. I got an email. Um, anyway, so now I have this composition and I can actually scale this down or something. I don't know. I really don't know what uh, the plan was for this video. Um, but so that, yeah, this is a whole composition. I guess I should add a background to this. So I'll just do a quick color. Um, sorry, this demo is not that cool, but uh, yeah, you guys should have fun, play around with it. And I'm sure there's some other stuff you can do with it. So I have one composition. Let's say I want to make this composition. I'll duplicate this into uh, some other composition. Uh, I don't know. I'll pick some horrible color. This dark red will look just great. Um, and then maybe delete this and say the next object I want is like a star and I want the star to just look like this. 
and I will make it blue and then I'll go back into my first composition or my wherever the second one was drop this uh, duplicated comp in uh, so that was uh, which one was it now uh, comp 3 so yeah just grab comp, comp 3 drop it on in we'll scale this guy down as well and then I'll just add magic to both of these layers I want to start on this comp 1 so I will just leave that as is on comp 3 I'll hit the magic flip and then just go and select comp 1 and or comp 3 and parent it to comp 1 and now when I rotate comp 1 it's going to magically change to the other composition so this will work as you're playing it if you want and there's some kind of animation happening uh, you can rotate it or something you can go lots of different directions but uh, hopefully the animation will still be playing ah uh, yeah there it is so woohoo it's playing uh, have fun with this uh, effect if you like this video uh, leave a like or drop a comment um, I, I am planning to get some videos up soon as well as some other freebies I keep getting way too busy with uh, stuff outside of work to uh, keep uploading videos regularly though I would love to because I love uh, doing that for you guys anyway if you like this video or the script itself uh, leave a like drop a comment subscribe to the channel uh, you guys are all awesome and uh, yeah get your learn on peace out guys